Episode of Storytime Anytime. Today we're going to be working on those math skills. Yep, you got it. Addition. We use addition every single day. Like when you go to a baseball game with your family and there are five of you and you all want hot dogs. If the vendor hands you two hot dogs, how many more do you need before you get to five? That's right, three. Then, when you go to pay for those hot dogs and the vendor tells you they cost $2.50, you have to add up all your money to make sure you give the vendor the right amount. So, let's go to the ballpark where we'll sing and learn more about addition. Have you ever been to a baseball game before? Here's a timeless classic that will surely get you excited about going to the ballpark. What an exciting game! All afternoon we've been battling to stay alive, and now at the bottom of the ninth, we have a chance. The score is tied six to six, and there are two outs. What's it gonna be? The pitch? It's going! It's going! It's out of here! It's a home run! We've won the game! Take me out to the ball game. Take me out to the park. Buy me some peanuts and cracker jacks. I don't care if I ever get back. I oh, will root, root, root for the home team. If they don't win, it's a shame. For it's one, two, Three strikes, you're out at the old ball game. You wouldn't add a run to the score if nobody scored, would you? The same rule applies when adding zero to any number. The answer stays the same. Adding one is like adding a single run to the scoreboard every time someone crosses home plate. Just count up one number.
plus two is two. Zero plus three is three. Zero plus four is four. Zero plus five is five. Zero plus six is six. Zero plus seven is seven. Zero plus eight is eight. Zero plus nine is nine. Join us on the Island of Learning as we learn how easy it is to add by twos.
dance. It's time to swing and move. It's time to learn our facts of two as we sing to the rhythmic groove. Two plus one is three, and two plus two is four. Let us move the limbo stick closer to the floor. Two plus three is five, and two plus four is Adding by two is as simple as counting up two more from that number. Let's sing about it and you'll see what I mean. I'm going to teach you a simple strategy when you're adding any number plus two. Just think two more than that number or that number plus two and you will solve the problem easily. This is called the two more than strategy. Let's play a little game while we learn more about this strategy.
Who likes to dance and learn at the same time? I know I do. Jump into this song with me while we learn addition facts for the number three. I'm jumping to the beat of the music. I'm jumping to the beat of the song. Yeah, I'm jumping to the beat of the music. Won't you come with me and jump along? I'm jumping to the beat of the music. I'm jumping to the beat of the song. Yeah, I'm jumping to the beat of the music. Won't you come with me and jump along? Yeah, I'm jumping up high, I'm clapping down low. I'm turning around and I'm touching my toes. I'm reaching real high and I'm giving a wave. As I'm learning all my facts today. Three plus one is four. Three plus two. by four is fun. So before you start practicing your math fact quiz, sit down and listen to this groovy song and see if you know the right answer to the problems. What do you say? What do you say? Plus 
2 is 4 plus 5 is 4 plus 8 is What do you say? What do you say? You learn the force and accomplishment What do you say? What do you say? You are truly magnificent What do you say? 5 plus 3 equals 8. 3 plus 5 also equals 8. It doesn't matter which order you arrange the numbers you're adding. The answer is always going to be the same. When you are learning addition facts, the numbers to be added together are called add-ins. The answer is called the sum. You can change the order of the add-ins around, but the sum will remain the same.
Studying, practice, and patience are key in learning anything, especially math. Making those three things become a part of your daily routine will have you hooked on learning and becoming better at everything. Repetition isn't just for helping with memorization. Every time you practice anything, you develop a deeper understanding behind whatever it is you're practicing. This is especially true when it comes to math.
plus four is eleven. Seven plus five is twelve. Seven plus six is thirteen. Let's say them over and over again. Seven plus four is eleven. Seven plus five is twelve. Seven plus six is thirteen. You won't hear the answers, but say them again. Seven plus four is. Seven plus five is. Seven plus six is. Plus nine is sixteen. Let's say them over and over again. Seven plus seven is fourteen. Seven plus eight is fifteen. Seven plus nine is sixteen. You won't hear the answers, but say them again. Seven plus seven is. Seven plus eight is. Seven plus nine is. Are you sitting down at a desk? Well, it's time to get up and exercise while we continue to learn our addition facts of eight. We're learning our facts three at a time. We're learning our facts while we exercise. Get out of your seats. Let's run in place. It's time to learn the facts of eight. We're learning. Nine is seventeen. 
two is ten. Eight plus three is eleven. Adding by nine can be intimidating, but learning the facts while singing an entertaining song is the best way to make anything you're learning fun.
plus four is eight. Five plus five is ten. Doubles, 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 and doubles mean two. Doubles, 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 doubles help you. They'll help you learn quickly. There are ten double facts. Doubles, doubles, doubles. We're talking doubly good math. Let's take six and double it twelve. Let's take seven and double it fourteen. Let's take eight and double it sixteen. Let's take nine and double it eighteen. Let's take ten and double it twenty. You've got the idea. You're learning plenty. Six plus six is twelve. Seven plus seven is fourteen. Eight plus eight is sixteen. Nine plus nine is eighteen. Ten plus ten is twenty. Doubles, 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 and doubles mean two. Doubles, 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 doubles help you. They'll help you learn quickly. There are ten double. A strategy called doubles plus one. If you know your double facts like two plus two and six plus six, you will find this strategy helpful. If you have a problem where one add end is one more than the other, you can think of doubles and add one more. Let's look at three plus four. In the problem three plus four, four is one more than three. So double three and add one. Three plus three is six, and six plus one is seven. That's it. Look at four plus five. Double four and add one more. Four plus four is eight, and eight plus one is nine. Great! Oh 
plus double one, which is two, and add one more. Three. Two plus three is five. Just double two, which is four, and add one more. Five. Three plus four is seven. Just double three, which is six, and add one more. Seven. Four plus five is nine. Just double four, which is eight, and add one more. Nine. Doubles plus one. Doubles. Green Podcasts. Be sure to hit subscribe. Parents, for an opportunity to win a $50 gift card, find us on Facebook by searching Twin Sisters Digital Media. Follow our page. Then just like and share our latest post. The winners will be announced on Facebook a week later. If your children enjoyed these songs and stories, go to TwinSisters.com to find even more ways for them to sing and learn. Be sure to subscribe to our newsletter for our free download of the day giveaways and promotions on exciting new digital learning content like these and much more. And visit our friends at evergreenpodcasts.com. Thank you for joining us at Storytime Anytime.